clockwork. Get ready, kid. at you. You can't stop. You gotta keep moving. You gotta... <sighs> you gotta keep putting one foot in front of the other. That's fine if all you want to do is go to the bathroom. There's gotta be more to life than that. What's for lunch? Loose meat sandwiches again? Yeah, what's wrong with them? They sit well. They sit so well, I put one foot in front of the other all the way to the bathroom. We really should have supervised athletics. I put six months for a shuffleboard court. They didn't listen. They didn't care. It was like talking to a wall. Shuffleboard? Nobody around here can even pick up a stick without hemorrhaging. <laughs> Shuffle for it. Oh, don't give up. You might still get one. Not in our lifetime, we won't. Why not? The explosion when we get to loose meat. What the hell have you got against loose meat, huh? It's about the only thing I can eat. Calm down, calm down. It's just the snow. The TV's broken. You'll be all right. Hello, Walter. 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 Have nine. Walter and Heather sitting in a tree. Walter's got a girl. <laughs> Keep singing and I'll kill you all. Let's get on with the game. We got a job to do. something Walter could use. One heart. Mm -hmm. Forget hearts, buddy. I want two clubs. I'm with you, Will. Two hearts. Crap. Two spades. <sighs> Pass. I'll use the extra club to beat my teammate. Three clubs. Two it for my blood. Pass. Clubs? Why can't, Walter? You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Three spades. Pass. Four clubs. 
Say spades again, and I'll bury you with one. Okay. Four. No trump. Ah, I quit. Please, Walter, Walter, come on. You see what I have to deal with? Calm yourself, Walter. Where did you learn to play cards? In an institution? Walter, I think you'll find in the grand scheme of things, this game really doesn't matter. Uh-oh, here we go. Everybody, hit the dirt. Yeah. Here I am. Hold it. You guys never agree. Life's tough enough. My roommate and I have decided to keep things simple. Huh? Well, let's go, simple. I got a splitting headache and I got to pee again. Oh. Ah, isn't life grand? Okay. See you, boys. So long, Ed. Will? I, you, you don't forget, you still owe me 30 oh, bucks. I'll forget that. This information just in on yesterday's half a million dollar armored car heist. The young boy involved in the heist, police say, was just a decoy for the three armed gunmen. The chief of police has scheduled a news conference to start in one hour in which more information will be released. It is presumed they're still hiding in town. Hume? What? How are the plants doing? They look good. The plastic one isn't doing much better either. Well, that's one less thing to worry about. How's your headache? I seem to have forgotten it. I wonder why. No shit, bonehead. Okay, you can get dressed. You're both finished. <laughs> you can say that again. Take these three times a day. For what? They'll make you feel better. I'm not a child. Just take them. saga of the armored car heist has taken a strange turn. The young boy believed to be involved, it now appears as being held as a hostage. What is the world coming to? Holding a child as hostage. Away. Come on, life's passing you by, Smiley. Okay, Smiley. Who's the old coot now, huh? Go on. You got your freedom? Okay. I'll take you out. We'll get you out of here. Someone else deserves this more than I do. Huh. It'll be good to get away. Want it, young? Hey, 
you, Walter. Joey. Have a good day. You too. You see the ass in that girl? <laughs> and it had to be this big. <laughs> Show some respect, will ya, you, you sick bastard? What the fuck? Joey, you missed a spot. Hey, old man, what's your problem? Nice uniforms. Where's the parade? No parade. Well, then where are you going? Uh, to the store. Now, what could you possibly need that the nurses couldn't give you? Condoms. Condoms? I guess I must be wearing the wrong uniform. <laughs> hey, not so fast, guys. I wasn't told anyone was coming through here. My, my, nobody told him. Now, which were you hired to do? Keep us in or rip rap out? Well, why do we even need a guard here? Oh, I know, because, come on, lots of dangerous looking old guys like that pass through here all the time. Oh, yeah. All the time, Gramps. Can I shoot them? Oh. Go play bingo. It's your lucky day. Well, have fun, fellas. <laughs> Fun, right. <laughs> hey, old man, we're coming right back. You're next. Give me that. Two. I'm great. Whereabouts in Hunt Ridge? Doesn't matter. House skirts will be fine. Whatever you say. Well, this is it. I didn't think you had the balls. I'd like some peace and quiet, please. What's the hurry? You're going to have plenty. Why are you doing it? Anyway, I mean, people generally like you. You don't piss them off like I do. Say that again. You seem to fit in. I mean, uh, why did you come? You seem to love it back there. You can back out right now. Ever been to Hunt Ridge before? Yeah. I was with my Boy Scout troop. I tied my first knot there. Me too. You a Scout? No. I got married at the end.
last time I took this trip, it cost eight and a half bucks with ten. Walter, the last time you took this trip, you had your own teeth and hair. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pull it. Pull it. Gentlemen, gentlemen, how much money do you have? Eleven thirty-seven. All right. Fine. I'll take it. Don't worry about it. Here. Take this. No, I can't take your watch. Oh, go on. I don't need it anymore. Take it. What do you mean, you don't need it anymore? Time's no longer an issue. I'm an old man. Come on. Make me happy. Take it, Wayne. All right, but, but take the money back. Take the money back. No, you keep that. Really? See you around. All right, fellas. What the hell were you thinking? Bringing so little money? Well, what the hell were you thinking, Mr. Four No Trump? Oh, that was a game. This is real life. What's the difference? What's the difference? In real life, my friend, you can't decide your fate by drawing a card or rolling some dice. Oh, really? What about the stock market? What about the rhythm method? Look at this place. It's awful. God, how could people be so thoughtless? Well, crying out loud, Walter. You're pissing on a tree. I know, but it evaporates. Look at this trash. Trash doesn't evaporate. Yeah, they should cut off their hands, all of them. They should cut off more than their hands. Come on. We got a job to do. This place is littered all the way up the trail. Does it really matter when you consider what we're about to do? Call me picky. But I don't want to spend eternity staring at a can of soda. Well, I want Dr. Pepper to be at the autopsy. Dignity is all we have left, Walter. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. Uh, you're trying to get us worried about how we're going to look when we're found? Is that it? Found? Found? If I wanted to be found, you know what I would have done? I would have done it over the vat of loose meat in the cafeteria. Found. Hell, when I'm dead, they can serve me with the loose meat. I don't care. You're the one who had to have the peace, quiet, and serenity of nature. Then we can do it my way? Sure. What's it worth to you? Got any more watches? Oh, just shut up. Ah, wait. I'm not empty. You're not going to sulk all day, are you? I'm not sulking. I'm ignoring you. Until you learn to stop trying to fix me up with jerks. That's my brother-in-law you're talking about. Well, <laughs> I hate to tell you, but your brother-in-law turned out to be a jerk. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey. Walter's been asking about you. Oh, here we go again. I'm serious. Hume said that Walter he... would not look at me twice, even if I stood dancing naked before him. Would you like to try it? Nope. I say we pay them a visit. Nope. <laughs> Yes. No litter. Yeah, this looks good. 
Are you sure, huh? The underbrush hasn't been cut back. And it lacks that certain Disney quality. Can't we get all the animals together for a sing-along? Yes, we could all join hands and sing Kumbaya. Well, this will have to do. My leg's killing me. Ah, my head's killing me. Ah. Ah. Your head's killing you? Ah. Take one of these. Ah. Let's get on with it. The gun. What's the matter? Oh, nothing. Dizzy spell. It'll pass. You sure? Yeah. <sighs> the last time I held one of these, I almost used it. Returned from Germany with it. You kill anyone in the war? Not really. I was in the 761st. Oh, the all-black tank battalion, huh? Ah, never saw anything like it. Gunner? Huh? Were you a gunner? No, uh, a navigator. Well, that's all you've been up till now. It's time now to... fire the cannons. Did you fire the, tor the torpedo? Uh, so you didn't kill anyone either. Well? I don't want to talk about it. Why? Because it wasn't in the war. What was it? Uh, shall we? Where do we point them? What do you mean, where should we point them? Try your left nut. Too late. Why do you think I limped? <clears throat> what? Shrapnel took out a hunk of my thigh and my left testicle. You lie. Hmm. Oh. Did it affect your... Um... You know. Not according to the doctor. They said you could live with one kidney and one garbanzo. Oh, could women tell? No. But I could. You couldn't take that story to the grave, could you? You had to tell it to me, now. Well, you brought it up. Uh, something I will regret to my dying day. <laughs> Come on, can we get on with it? So where are you, Amy? Well, I've always heard that it's best to hold the gun in your mouth. Harder to miss? I suppose. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I paid a lot for my bridge work, too. It's funny the, the things you think of at a time like this. I don't want to know. Now, about the uh, eye issue. What eye issue? <laughs> Open the clothes. That's it. If you don't shut up, I'm going to kill you. Oh, very funny. Now, one more thing. Uh, what? I say we should do it on the count of four. Four? Why not three? Uh, you want to die before your time? Very funny. Well, I'll see you on the other side. Oh. You don't 
suppose we're going to be roommates, do you? If I go to hell, I suppose we will. Oh, damn, I got a leak again. No, I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it now. Now he's ready. All right, let's do it. On four. One, one two, three. One. Oh, you know what I just thought of? What? <laughs> it's been years ago. My kid, she used to drink water from her water pistol like this. <laughs> One, two, three. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up. Man, I must have been drunker than I thought. I can't tell one tree from the next. What about you? You recognize any of this? No, it all looks the same to me. Not without the map. I told you that. Kid? Come on, Marshal. I need a map. Then I'll be able to tell you. Yeah, if only we had the map, right? Wish I knew who had it. Yeah, me too. I know who has it. His brother. Hey, come here. Get your shovel. Give him a bag. Go sit down over there. I want to talk with Wes. Okay, get over there. What are we going to do about this? Get on your knees, Wes. Not funny, Get on your fucking knees. I'm not fucking with you. Get on your knees. Get on your fucking knees. What are you doing, man? Where's the map? I got the map. Where's the fucking map? I don't got it. You can have Jason's chair. You think this is about money? No. I'm going to give you a better break than you gave my brother. There's your gun, Wes. Go for Robert, it. Please. Go for your gun, Wes. Go for the gun. You have it all. On three, Wes. On three. One. Two. Three. One. getting away. So? So? So we got to do something. Yeah, hi. Oh, you don't mean that. What about the kid? They believe you're watching TV. Quick, turn it off. Out of sight, out of mind. Oh, how can you say that? That kid's going to die. So am I. Oh, look, I'm with you. But I'll be damned if I'm going to let that kid die without raising a hand to try to stop him. Look, you do what you want. I'm staying right here. Go do what you want. Oh, poor Walter. Jesus. Think about that kid down there, huh? Hey, you go ahead and kill yourself if you want. But before I die... Just once, I want to see some justice. Where are the guns? They fell over. Well, let's go find them. They fell right around here. <clears throat> Joey, have you seen Walter and Hume? Yeah, they came by here this morning. I saw them up by the gate. They were getting into a cab. Let's go home. Hey, give me those, will you? I'll catch you later, Joey. Okay, right. Walter! Hume! Anyone there? No. I never saw it so neat. You've been invited? Oh, no, I, I meant just uh, in passing. Close the door quick. What exactly are we looking for? I don't know. Well, something will turn up. They fell right around here. Uh-oh, oh, they're getting away. Oh, just give me a minute. We haven't got one. 
We can't lose them. Oh, come on, Walker. Come on. Oh, my God. For a friend. For you. For Ed. Sweat us the thrift shop for oh, Harry. My. Hey, are you sure you know where it is? Yeah, it's over there. All right, come on. Where? Right there. Leave right here. Where? Wait! It's not over here. It's down here. Come on. They're just ahead, I tell you. They better be. We don't know where we are. I'm sorry. I can't help you. You mean you won't? It's only been a few hours, as I understand it. And if I was to call the police every time one of you decides to take a walk, they'd have no time for anything else. We saw their closet. Yeah, but maybe they wanted to make room for new clothes. Come on, Mr. Maiden, stop talking to us as if we were dumb. Look, let me break it down to you. You folks are doing crazy things all the time. There's no major crises because your friends decided to label all their clothes. I'm not going to put an APB out on them for that. Mr. Mayhew, are you sure it isn't because you're tired of Walter bothering you for better food and a shuffleboard court? Mrs. Andrews, you must think I'm a pretty petty man. Oh, no, Mr. Mayhew. We don't think of you as a man at all. Come on, Heather. That's telling him, Fran. <laughs> what? I'm like thirsty. Uh, let's keep it that way. You haven't been watering trees as much. Yeah, that's true. They've been walking an awful long time. I think they're lost. No. That kid is faking. What? This path leads right back to where we were. Come on. So, what's with the throat? Cancer. No big deal. What? Everybody on the sub's got it now. How'd it happen? You know? They shoved radium capsules up our noses. Supposed to help with pressure change problems. Instead, we got headaches. Sinus problems, dizzy spells, 20 to 40 years later. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. I think they're over there. Is the boy still with them? I believe so. I don't care. What do you mean you don't care? I don't care about that. How could you not care? Uh, I wonder where 
where they are. Who? Where? Who? Walter and him. What? Oh, Heather? Yeah, take my card. All right? If you need me for anything, call me. Come on, let's go. He still owes me 30 bucks, that Walter does. <laughs> I, I hope he never pays him. Give me the cards. Give me the cards. to the head is out, right? I've been thinking of jumping off tall things. You know, buildings, cliffs, trees, basketball players. Nasty. Oh, that lets out risk for it, and ferocious animals. You were thinking about being eaten? We're part of the food chain. Carbon monoxide, then. You suffocate, you know it, but you don't care. You just fall asleep. <laughs> Good idea. There's just one problem. Mm, what's that? Neither of us owns a car. <laughs> we could borrow one. Oh, yeah. We could ask this guy that we're following if he could help us out. Glasses. Check the bureau. Oh. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh. Okay. Look. Ah. You. You. You think you can give me a lift? I was in. What do you think I am? Rambo? Oh. Uh, well, at least give me a push. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Here. All right. Here. Here I go. Uh, wait a minute. Okay. Uh, that's good. Uh, almost there. Ah. Uh, 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 all right. Wait a minute. I'll find a vine. They're still, uh, they're still there, digging. I wonder what his family's like. Probably uncaring. I lay odds, sir. They abandoned him. I asked about his family, Walter. Not mine. Wow. So 
So what? Look how well you turned out. Yeah. Terrific. So terrific my wife left me. Did you treat her right? Sometimes I think I was the most understanding, most caring, most giving husband. Why did she leave? My injury. Didn't matter how it affected me. What mattered was how it affected her. Apparently, nothing I did for her out of bed mattered much. Losing being a man is one thing, but losing your family because of it is another. One time, when Kenny was six, I had permission to visit on Father's Day. Our time together was strange as usual. I could tell he was tolerating me, looking forward to seeing his stepfather in the afternoon. He gave me a store-bought card. No note, no whoosh, just his name, signed in pencil. I pretended to drive away, went around the block, came back and waited. She saw me out there, but she didn't care. When he pulled up, And he gave him such, such a greeting. Arms outstretched, hugs, kisses, even a present. As I watched, I realized I could, I could never regain the family I'd lost. And it hurt. I've come a long way, Walter. I can't continue. So you haven't seen him in all of these years? Kenny wants nothing to do with me. I'm an embarrassment. He'd rather I didn't exist. What about you? Anyone care if you exist? I'd rather not talk about it. It's not here. Where is it? Probably over there. Grab the bag. He figured something out. Let's go. found something.
some of this stuff around. Okay, everybody, come on. Everybody with comfortable shoes. Come on, this way. What are you doing? Uh, uh, I'm making a tourniquet. With a flag? <laughs> a lot of good it's doing us. Social Security, Medicaid, your throat. get it. After being in a war and seeing death, why are we sitting here frightened? Why didn't we just kill ourselves? Now it's ringing not confronted by it. Uh, you can make such a choice. When I was a kid, I built a fort in the woods in the afternoon. Smell like this. If I was rowdy, my mama used to make me sit on the porch until I calmed down. It seemed like hours. But I remember how how beautiful it was. Trees against the blue sky. Yes, I remember. Play a game, boy! Let's go! Hell out of there! No, I think we're all here already. We've got to have to start again. Come on, girl. How's your shoulder? Oh, not good. How bad am I?
can't tell. You think I'm gonna die? <laughs> Not from that. Water. Water. It was my fault. I told you I killed somebody. What I didn't tell you was it was my drinking. My family. I couldn't see. I never should have taken him out there in the first place. All that screaming. I just couldn't save them. But it wasn't just the water. If I hadn't been drunk, I could have saved them. If you ask me, if I get time, I'm still doing it. From then until now, every moment. Huh? You know, I'm a Navy man, and I'm horrified of what. <laughs> when my wife and daughter died, I stopped drinking. I, I denied myself all pleasures. <laughs> the other way I treated what's her name, Heather, just pushed her away. My family can no longer enjoy pleasure. Watch her up. Yeah? And yet? Here we are. About to kill ourselves, be chased by a murderer, bleeding from a bullet, lying in the dirt. And I feel kind of content. <clears throat> what is this? This morning everything was dull. Sounds were muted, smells not as sharp. Yeah. It occurred to me, we've been living like we've been dead for so long. Killing ourselves now would, would be redundant. We picked a hell of a time to realize this. It's party time, boys. Let the games begin. You do. Oh, yeah. I think we're lost. No, we're not. We're by this same tree again. What is it, three times now? Oh, great. Walter and Hume will return to Saxton, and four of us will die out here. Come on, let's try this way. Oh, yeah, I'm the leader.
We'll be getting dark soon. Yeah. We, we ought to have our heads examined. Oh. Well, come on. I have to run another step, I'll die. Me too. Uh, uh, I need my medicine. Huh? You know, we came out here because we got sick of taking orders and medicines. No more, Walter. Maybe this was meant to be. We won't both make it. Uh-uh, you know, I'm not gonna leave you. If you stop, I stop. You sure? You can go home. See Heather. You deserve happiness. <laughs> Go. <laughs> well, you got us. Now what? Oh, gee. It's nice to see you too, boys. You killed that guy and that kid. Yeah. How, how could you? <laughs> hey, what are you nuts, old man? I mean, look, I got a gun in my hand. Hey, you know, I think you got some kind of a dead wish. I'll make this wish come true. Oh! <laughs> now, I'm going to ask you something. And I'm only going to ask you this the one time. What the fuck did you see? We, we saw you shoot that boy in the back. You, you're sick. <laughs> yeah, I know. And you should have lied to me. But now... Since you saw everything, you're gonna die. Well, you would believe me. Hey, I might have. <laughs> I really might have. Damn. Now I gotta kill two more people. Mm, that's okay. Huh? Oh, we came in here to kill ourselves. Help us out. What? Do it already. You heard him. We were planning to shoot ourselves. When we heard your little party. Why did you follow me? Huh. To turn you in or to die doing it. I no, hope saved the kid. You could have let him go. Yeah, I could have, but I didn't. Well, someday you'll wish you had. I don't get it. 
Oh, you'll get it someday. You'll get it when you try to go to the bathroom and can't. And then, when there's no bathroom and you do. Or you'll get it when your teeth start to crack and you swallow them with your food. Or you'll get it when you enter a room and you don't remember why. Or if you remember why, you don't remember who the hell you are. <laughs> you'll get it when the people you care about are gone. You long to be next to him, to talk to him, to hold him. And then you decide to end it all yourself. Shut the fuck up. Now, how are you gonna do this? Shoot ourselves. With what? See, you don't want to get old. I lost the guns. All right, where are the guns now? We tossed them. Don't ask us where. We're hopelessly lost. Oh, this is unfucking believable You mean you two morons spend the entire day trying to kill yourselves and I had to chase you through the forest fucking shooting at you? Something ain't right. Now, I gotta kill two more people. I don't even really want to. I'll tell you what. I'll make you a deal. If you promise not to say anything, I'll let you go. No. no. No? No. No. Then I'm gonna have to shoot you. Yeah. Do it already. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? What was in that box back there? Nothing. Nothing much. Maybe three. My brother and I, we, we were very close. We were like a father to me. We, we robbed his armored car, we buried the money. Wes, that faggot that you saw me pop, he was in on it with us, and so was the kid. Then, you know, Wes got greedy, and he, uh, he, he stole the man. Now, in order to do that, put a bullet in my brother's head. Now, what was I supposed to do? Let him go? No, no, no! I enjoyed killing him. What did the kid do? Well, he became a pain in my ass. He had me walking around in circles. I couldn't trust him. I look, look, look. Come on, come on. Now, school is out. It's time to meet your maker. you let us kill ourselves? What do you say? Oh, up we go. Oh, He's lost a lot of blood. Be careful okay. with him. Oh, oh my get him God. Out of here. We've got to get him to the hospital. Would you please help us kill ourselves? You know, after what you guys did to me, maybe I'm going to enjoy this, but I'm telling you now, if you pull any of your tricks, I'm going to do more than kill you. Well, he's jumping off places. Still out? <laughs> I'd prefer not. They're too messy. They reminds him of loose meat sandwiches. What's left? Hanging. Hanging? Well, there are plenty of vines. All we have to do is find the right tree. I know just the right spot. See West from over there, that fucking hump. Oh, how nice. I guess we should start finding our vines. Yeah, we can. Oh, 
If we keep looking, I know we'll find what we need. Uh, if we do, I'm not sure I know what to do with it. Hey, come on, just grab any vine. What's the fucking difference? Ready? No. These aren't strong enough. We're gonna have to double and triple them up. No, we won't. They're fine. Let's do it. Walter, it won't work. They'll snap. Trust me, they'll hold it. Hey, I'm from Alabama. You think you know more about hanging than me? Come on, hurry it up. Ooh, I'm going to radio Saxon and see if they've returned, right? You know, you realize we can't do this. You better do this. You heard what the man said. We got to do it. But how? If we put these vines uh, around... sir, we want to make... A practice try. Hey, what the fuck for? There are many things to consider. For example, is the vine long enough? Is the slope of the ground steep enough? It's a precise science. Okay, we're ready. On four again? No, three this time. Four got us in trouble then. Okay. One, One. Two, two. Three. three. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Jump, old man! Sound. Pretty clear. And the smell? Still punch it. And the colors. <laughs> Looks great to me. <laughs> How about you? Bright. Uh, which way? You're the navigator. Let's go. We're almost home, free Walter.
Oh, we're back. Oh, God, not you again. In one day? <laughs> I'll see you at the hospital. We'll be right behind you in the taxi. Don't worry, Walter. I'll be there. Be right with you, buddy. sat outside your window all day. Why did you guys have to go out and try that stupid thing? Whether you know it or not, people care for you. I mean, we all care for you. I care for you. If you'd only give me a chance. Give me a chance, will you? Well, Heather, it just isn't the same at the home without you. Oh, it's a hell of a lot better. I mean, we get to come here. <laughs> oh. Well, how long has it been since Walter left us? Uh, been a good, good 11 months. I am not coming back. I only moved to get away from you hard luck slobs. <laughs> That's, I've had enough. Sit down, Bill. Uh, oh. Who else are we expecting? Shh. Come in. Hello, everybody. Hello, oh, Joey. Oh, surprise. Hope you don't mind. I'm back. It's the kid. Oh. Hey. Uh. <laughs> oh. Hey, aren't you the one I almost got killed for? You all your life. Come on, man. Get over here. Give me five, my man. Hey, hey. Oh. Hey, Joey. Hey, Joey. Hey, Joey. I just want to say thank you for everything. Oh. Oh, it's too bad. Too bad Fran and you couldn't be here. Yeah, right. We got a card from him. <laughs> Where is that card? Over by the bills. Uh, there's the <clears> one <throat> thing I miss about the home. What? What? No bills. <laughs> 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 uh, Wedding night was great. Gave Hume back his purple heart. Believe me. I made him earn it. Uh, you almost wounded again? <laughs> I'll bet it's not his heart that's purple this time. What's the matter with you? You don't know what I'm talking Where you guys going? Oh, that's a lot of loose meat, huh? Hey, 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 hey. I just want to say, shut up. I just want to say how much it means to me to have all you guys here on Thanksgiving. I don't know about you guys, but Heather and I sure got a lot to be thankful for. I want to make a toast. I want to yeah. make a toast. All right. All right. To yeah. Walter and to you. Uh, and you. to Heather and Fran and uh, Will. Will and Ed and Jonathan. Jerome. And Jerome. And Carl, our friend Carl. And everybody's